Hello, this is Cindy. Welcome to my channel and to Walk Through Wednesday. And I have a beauty for you today to take a look at. Look at this lacy, frothy piece of journaling. So it is closed with this really pretty, elegant piece of ribbon. It has a piece that comes down, hangs down here, and there's a little mini journal on the front with several places to write and sketch and a couple little cards in, inside hiding in the pockets. And then this flips out and I left this blank so you could write your own title on here. You name the journal. It is when you buy the journal, you get to name the journal. All right, opening it up, we have, this is a cloth cover, obviously a lace on, lace on the front, cloth on the inside. There is a pocket here. This is a flip out with another pocket and a journaling card that's inside. A belly band with a pocket or a tag and a little envelope with some goodies inside of it. I'm not going to show them all to you because there should be some surprises when you if you purchase this. You should have a few surprises, right? All right, that goes inside there. A little vellum that I used my jelly plate on. Another uh, of a vertical belly band with a pocket. Or, well, I say a pocket. It's a tag with a pocket. And a piece, a place to write. There are a lot of places to write on this. I left you lots of places to write. There's another pocket here with another tag inside. Lots of places to write here. All right, we have a paper clip with a little bit of ribbon on it and another envelope, and this envelope is stuffed with all sorts of goodies. I'm going to put that back this way. The primary theme of this, besides lacy frothiness, would be yellow roses. And then this is just a little piece to write on, and I tucked it right up underneath in there. Some coffee dyed paper with a really pretty design on it. A little bit of doily. And I used a little bit of doily up at the top on this page as well. But there are places, and you can write along the whole thing, or you can write little pieces. Just however you choose to use it up. The papers came, most of them came from the All Things Roses uh collection and I will put the link to that down below. Just a couple more journaling spots, a little cluster I put together before. Just another little cluster collage type thing and of course in here there is another envelope with some more goodies in it and some other little goodies all tucked down inside there. Another cluster up at the corner more places to write, more things tucked inside here. A little bit of lace on the side here. And then I just, I fell in love with this paper. This is Stamperia paper. Um, I don't remember the name of the collection, but it opens and it just tucks inside here. So you have lots of places to write. This is a cool writing spot and a waterfall. Places to write on the front or on the back. And then again, on this side, you can write in the little places. You can write on the doily. We have a little tuck spot here with a nice big journaling card. That's a nice big spot. And of course, you can journal in here as well. 
And then we have a trio of tags here, just three of them put together and tucked inside a little lacy pocket with a nice little bow. Book page. Oops, I've turned two pages. There's another piece with a flip out. This is another, there's a smaller paper clip with a little over the top. And this is just a little journaling spot. You can open it up all the way and hide some writing in there if you would like. And just tuck that back on there. And then the paper clip just goes over the top with a little bit of ribbon. The other part of that belly band. And this has a nice big piece of paper, again, for writing on. And a really pretty journaling card with a few sparklies on the journaling card. This one is attached, but there you go. I told you lots of places to write in this one and a lot of them hidden. So you kind of got to look around for them. And then the back cover, another pocket with another journaling card. And then the back is all that lace. So how many pages is this? I never did count. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. There's fourteen in here. Fourteen times four is forty eight, sixty, fifty. Four. 54 pages plus the little journaling piece in the beginning that flips out. So this will be for sale in the in my coffee shop. I hope you enjoyed this walkthrough. And until later, this is Cindy signing off.